Morning, everybody. So the question I have for you today, and I'd like you to do a little research on it, can exercise really be medicine? So find that out and um, let me know what you got. Okay, so here's what I think you'll need today. Um, and once I'm done talking, go ahead and you can stop the video and get it. Get a jump rope because I think I want to jump a little bit and get some kind of a little animal. You'll see why uh, towards the end of the workout. Okay, so let's get started with our warm up. Okay, so what I'd like to do for our warm up is start with some arm circles. Make them a little bit bigger. Spread your legs a little bit. Okay, make them real big and really stretch out your arms. And then go the other way. Okay, great. Okay, now let's just swing from the hips a little bit. Let your arms just go real loose. Get a little bit more hip action in there. Okay, good. Next. Oh, let's just do some knee lifts. So lift your knee up to alternate elbows. Keep it up. Make sure you're getting that knee up pretty high. And then I think I wanted to do some lunges. Okay, so stand straight like that. Lunge out, bend your knee, come on back. Keep it up. Okay, good. Got your heart rate up a little bit. That's really the important thing in a warm up is to get that heart rate elevated a little bit, stretch your muscles out a little bit. Okay, so we're going to do a bit here of challenge. This time, instead of doing our arms, let's do a sumo sit. Okay, let's shoot for, I think I wanted to do about. A minute and 15 with you guys so let's go ahead and start get either on a wall we're gonna do it to to guess the 430 if you can do it if you can't do it then just stop that's the goal so instead of looking at the clock just feel what your body feels like as we stay in this position Okay, and I know you're going to feel something with uh, the level of discomfort, and that's okay. Now you're going to make a choice whether you're going to stop or whether you're going to continue. Okay, if it's too much for you, then go ahead and stop. For those of you who can keep going, go another 15 seconds. Okay, great. Okay, whatever you did, that's excellent. Remember that the hero point is that point where you are making a choice whether you're going to continue or not. All right, excellent. Okay, so uh, you know what? Let's, um, well, we'll wait for the jump rope. You can do the jump rope. Um, after the workout. So let's go ahead and get going with our workout. And remember what we did last time. I have 10 exercises here. I have 10 cards. I'm going to pull a card. We're going to do that exercise for 45 seconds. OK, 
Okay, so let's get started. And the first one's going to be, let me shuffle and just pull a random one. Number four is a V-sit. Okay, so let's get down to a V-sit. Get ready. Legs up, toes pointed. And we're going to see if we can hold it for 45 seconds. Now remember, I've asked many of you to help create the workout and email me what exercises you want to see done. Some of you have done that, and I want to thank the four people that have entered an, ex an exercise, and we're going to do their exercises in between the ones that I randomly pull. So the first one will be, Ben, thanks for, oh, <laughs> Ben, you know what, we're going to wait. We're going to wait, because you'll see why. So we're going to move to Edan. Thanks for sending your choice in. That was Jumping Jacks. Oh, I can't remember where we started, so hold it up for another couple seconds. Okay, and stop. All right, so remember, email me your choice of the exercises, and I'll go through them in a second. So, but Edan, you wanted to do jumping jacks. Thank you, that gets our heart rate up. So let's get going, and let's go ahead and do some jumping jacks. We're gonna do it for 45 seconds. see what that is. Got about another 15 seconds. This really gets our heart rate up. And five more. And stop. Okay, excellent. So the exercise that I have is a plank walk. If you remember what that is, you get down the plank, you walk up like that, we have a squat jump, which is this, okay, push-ups, we know what that is, V-sit, today number five is a, a Zhigong punch, if you remember, number six is a Zhigong speed punch, tree pose, tricep rollback is this, where you go up. And then we have a crab walk. And then from the crab position, we have this toe touch. Okay? All right. So we just did Edan's. Let's pick a random one again. Ideally, what I, we're going to do 10 exercises. Ideally, I'd like to have 10 of you create the workout. Right now, we have four of you. So I need six more people to email me with their choices. And let's do number two, which is a squat jump. Uh, let's wait until we get to nine. Oh, well. Okay. All right, so we get down to squat and jump. It's only 15 seconds. This is tough to do for 45. So if you can't do it for 45, do it for 30. This is 30. Those of you can keep going, keep going. Great workout. Woo, I'm starting to feel it. A couple more. Woo, I'm cooked. All right. Marissa, you, <clears throat> you asked for us to do the inchworm walkout. I love it too. So let's get started. Down, walk up, plank, walk back, and up. Straight legs throughout the whole exercise. Down, 
and straight legs get into a plank and walk back up keep going see if you can do 45 seconds Good. Okay, good. All right, so let's pick another. And the answer will be, oh, no, that's two again. All right, that's what the luck of the draw says. So we're going to do a squat jump. I'm not sure I'm going to be able to do 45 seconds. Because I was really feeling that last time. Let's wait until we get to 11.15. Ready? Go. Stay with me. I can see my form is starting to get a little bit weaker. My jump's not as high. Keep it up. Ooh, 20 more seconds. I'm gonna see if I can do it. I'm really past getting to my the here point. Oh. Okay, great. Okay. Adam. Thank you for sending me in. Your choice. Let's get into a plank position and go. Whew. Oh, I think we have one more random exercise to do. I certainly hope it's not number two again. Another 20 seconds. Fifteen. I don't know if you can see this or not. Five more seconds. Okay, good. All right. Okay. So, so actually we're just doing, I really don't care what we do. We're just moving it. We just do it, get up and do it. And it really doesn't matter what we do to some extent. Okay, let's hope it's not a number two. And I'm picking this one. Number seven. Oh, good. Tree pose. Ready? See if you can balance. These balances become a lot harder when we really have worked out our lower legs and we really did today with the two squat jumps the sumo sit okay let's go to the other side and the last one is going to be what did i say with yeah, Ben. I think, no, was it Ben? Yeah, Ben, I thank you for sending that in. And it was a V-sit. Okay, so let's get in a V-sit again. If you can have your hands up, do that. Point your toes like a gymnast. couple more seconds. So I want about six more of you to send in your choice and then we'll create a workout specific to you guys. Okay, so from this position, let's just go ahead and cool down a little bit. Let me see what I want to do with the cool downs. I want to get into a butterfly. Butterfly. Wow. 
wave your legs, your heart rate slowing down. Okay, from here, keep one leg in. Now reach down to your knee, slide your hands down to your ankle. If you can grab your toe with one hand, with two would be great, I can't do it. Pull your, pull your ankle back or your toe back and just keep it there. Okay, let's do the other side. Foot up as in it's in a tree pose. Keep your legs straight. Slide your hands down to your ankle if you can. Grab your toe if you can. Pull your toe back. Okay, let's get on our knees. Sit back on your on your ankles. If you can, if you can't do that, just go to where you can. And then I want you just to rise up. Put your hands on your hips. Put your hips out a little bit. Then go back down. Hips out. And down. If you're wearing a baseball cap for this next one, you're going to have to turn it around. From this position, I want you to put your forehead on the mat. I like to put my hands by my toes, put my hands by my toes if you can hear me, and just relax. Okay, now here's where the animal comes in. Just watch me. So we're going to get into a laying down position. Whatever animal you have or some something to put on your belly. Move your head around. Okay, now just relax here. Put your hands, your palms on the ground. When you breathe in, breathe in and see if you can let whatever you have on your belly rise up. And feel it dropping as you ex excel your, exhale your air in your lungs. Okay, breathe in. And it goes up. Breathe out. And it drops. Okay, keep that up. We're going to do it for another minute. Okay, I'm going to stop because I'm going to stop the tape, but you can keep going with that. Just make sure when you're done, when you get up, you just get up nice and slow, go to your knees. Go to one knee, maybe stretch out, go to the other knee, and then come on up. Okay, and lastly, you have your jump rope, go outside and jump for a little bit. Let's get really good at this skill. Okay, excellent job today. See you next time.